Hello everyone, I'm Shubh and welcome to my course on F1 Aerodynamics. Well, in this course, we will try and learn about the fundamentals of aerodynamics that are required to understand the aero mechanisms at play around F1 cars. And yes, we will dive into case studies like never done before on the internet in which we will look at the 2023 F1 cars, the 2022 F1 cars and we'll also try and compare cars against each other to try and see some of the differences in the aero philosophies at play. So when it comes to me, I have a bachelor's in aerospace engineering wherein I basically dived and learned the fundamentals of aerodynamics during my bachelor years. I worked with Bell Helicopters for three years after my bachelor's as an aerodynamicist and a performance engineer which kind of laid down the foundations of working on really intense research projects with big companies like Bell Helicopter. And then I decided to take a leap of faith into the love of my life, that was F1 cars, right? And I did my master's in racing car design at Italy, specializing in aerodynamics. And that master's really gave me the exposure to the entire motorsport industry that was present in Italy. And also gave me the opportunity to apply for Red Bull Racing F1 team. And when the opportunity came, I took it with both hands. I got selected as a student placement for the 2021 and the 2022 championship in which I contributed as an aeronamicist fundamentally on the front wing and operationally helping the team out on race weekends. So this was an absolutely mind-blowing experience which has given me insights into the industry as well as a lot of technical background to try and understand and explain concepts to you guys. So here I am trying to use all the experience and everything that I've learned, trying to package it into this course. Now, the fun does not end there because I really want this course not just to be a technical course, but also a guide as to how you can make it into F1. Uh, so I start the course by giving you my experiences in F1 and some of the unfiltered stories that have not been told or heard by a lot of people. Um, with big personalities that you might have seen with the on the TV. So I speak about my time at Red Bull and the stories with these people. And then I try to talk about how to get a job in F1 in terms of preparing your CV, preparing your cover letter, uh, applying for the student placement program and how you should prepare for your aerodynamics interview at the end of the course um, where we talk about how to get a job in F1. But it also does not end there because I'm really, really committed in terms of giving you the maximum impact for this course. So after you've successfully completed the course, you can book a career counseling session with me. You can also book an aero discussion session in which we go about, you know, the entire 2023 car. We can talk about updates. So we can book a session for aero discussion. And then I give you a handover of some of the post-processing that I have of the 2023 cases so you can have them for reference and you can also use them as study material or reference material for your work and then the big one we're going to give you a demo model of the 2023 f1 car which you guys can play with in SolidWorks and this is great because after you've learned, you know, the entire of aero philosophies and the aero mechanisms, it's up to you to try and change the geometry, to try and play with this because that's what really you're going to do if you get a job in F1, right? So I want you guys to take home all these benefits. So come on board, do this course, complete it, and then have those sessions with me and take the model home. And then you will be equipped to really really put yourself in a position to try and someday become an F1 aerodynamicist.